Hey everybody, welcome to some late night chalking. Well, it's not that late, but it's kind of late. Welcome to the replay. Hope everybody is having a great night. Hi Karen. We're, I'm going to make an apron just in time for a great holiday weekend and a really, um, this would be a really great Father's Day gift also. If you have a a guy who likes to grill in your life, or even cook for that matter. This transfer is called Grill Master. Oh, hi, Erin. I almost wish that, uh, I can't, well, I can't even tell you guys the story. It's kind of funny. Hi, Crystal. Hey, Kathy. Hi, Nikki. So I'm gonna make this apron, and it is going to be, um, grill themed <coughs> for the grill master and our grill just um, broke and we ended up having to put it out um, on the curb we had to get rid of it and we have not bought a new one hi Simone we are going to get a new one but we don't have one for this weekend so we're actually not grilling but that is okay that doesn't mean that we won't um, you know, be somewhere where they'll be grilling. But anyway, this is a fun uh, transfer. It also has number one best dad or number one dad or best, um, uh, you know, whatever you want to put. I'll tell you all the words. Grilling and chilling uh, on the menu. So if you were having like a fun outdoor barbecue or event outdoor you could make some really cool signs like a really cute chalkboard menu um, that has like here's like a little brat hot dog type thing um, but I'm gonna do the grill and it's gonna say grill master well maybe it's gonna say grilling and chilling for real, like for real, for real, guys. It's gonna say grilling and chilling. I'm still, you know, why I'm up number one because uh, today's Friday and it's my favorite day of the week. Number two, I had to take my son to an appointment today, so I ended up um, having to leave work half a day. So. Um, and it was super sunny and hot and wonderful today um, in Michigan. And so um, as we drove by, the pool is open, so we went to the pool. And so I had um, a really great day. My boys took my boys to the pool for the first day um, this year. And my other son, or my older son, had field day so we hung out there for a little while like it was just a nice day and I am still up because in real life I am not lame and I do not go to bed early every day hi Diane hi Carol so this is a brand new transfer that I have and you guys get to see it all cut up I am going to so I have my ink mat I have my apron that I'm making, got my inks, and I got my transfers. So now all I have to do is put it all together. So let's pick up woo, all the pieces and set it aside. I'm just kind of like make my piles. Okay. Put my, I'm going to put my um, ink mat, I'm going to take the plastic off. And set that aside there we go then I am going to lay this down uh, um, and just kind of spread it out onto the sticky mat you can see that this is a sticky mat oh I love hot sunny days I love the pool I love summer and I love Fridays so, everything worked out well for me today, um, off, and it was great, and my kids were in a good mood, so that makes everything 
everything good. And you know what the best part is? I didn't have to cook dinner. We didn't cook dinner. Um, we didn't do anything fancy, but um, my son, my eight-year-old was like, can't we just have a snacky dinner? And I was like, uh, sure. And um, so they had a snacky dinner and I got to have leftovers from last night, which was really yummy because we got Chinese. So, so everything was great and I didn't have to cook. All of that stuff makes me happy. Happy, happy. So I'm gonna put the, um, the grill here. Now, normally I would do this like a black grill, but since we have a black apron, I'm gonna do, well, I was gonna do silver because like you could have a uh, stainless steel grill, but then I remembered we have taupe, which is like a grayish, so I think this will be good in taupe. I wasn't really sure if my husband would want shimmering silver. I mean, maybe, but also maybe not. Uh, so we're going to do taupe, and then we've got some colors to do the flames. I'm not quite sure. I might do a little mixture. <clears throat> I have like a red and an orange and a yellow. And then... Um, we are definitely going to do grillin' and chillin' as soon as I find the chillin'. Oh, wait, this is chillin'. Ha! Grillin' and chillin'. Just because I'm up doesn't mean I'm, like, super lucid. Grillin' and chillin', and, um, quite possibly I could do, like, the little icons down there um, and I think we are going to do the flames and the smoke coming out of the grill so yeah I think this is gonna be fun very fun I might do this I don't know I may not use these at all but I definitely will do the words so let's kind of get this laid out I know that these, so we have a really cool two-step. We've got the flame base, and then we have like a flame overlay that's going to be a different color. So I can do like like an or, a red, orange, and then do these yellow, which I think would be really cool. So let's get our grill on. <laughs> let's get our grill on, guys. Okay, now I'm just getting goofy. Oh, I better write the word back on the back of this. By the time you get to be my experience level with these, you kind of know, number one, what the difference between the front, the shiny side, and the back is. But because I have people come and use my stuff, I still want to kind of have it labeled. And then sometimes I'm just delirious and I can't tell what the front and the back is. Hi, Janine. How are you tonight? All right, so here goes my, just lay that down sticky, set my transfer aside, and we're gonna use taupe. So I'm gonna open it up right over here. Uh-oh. Gosh, I keep, I don't, I'm so not an I, iPad person. Uh, totally. I love it when I don't have to cook as well. Last night, I was so exhausted. I came home and I, well, I messaged my husband. And I was like, um, seriously, I will do anything. Just pick up takeout or something. I don't even care what it is. I will eat anything. I am not going to be picky. I just do not want to cook. And so he got Chinese and it was delish. Um, and I had some leftover for today, which was awesome. And um, that's why I didn't have to cook two days in a row. And that is my favorite part. That is my favorite part of my two nights. I don't know. I don't know how else to explain that. But um, I don't mind cooking if A, I have time, and B, I have everything I need. I actually enjoy cooking if I had time and everything I need and didn't have to, like, make special trips to the store. 
um, but our household is slightly backwards than most traditional homes. My husband does the grocery shopping, and um, that, that is totally fine by me. I mean, I don't know if um, you guys, like, have a traditional, you know, like you go do the groceries or your husband does the groceries or whatever, but that is the way we do it because I, like, my commute is all of about nine miles through the country. <laughs> I work in a rural area, and I, there's no, like, I can't run somewhere after work. I definitely would have to make special trips. My husband works in another town, so he goes through town to get there, and so he can easily, like, stop for groceries on the way home or something like that. No biggie. Hi, Victoria. Hello, hello. Okay. Oh, that looks so good. Can you see? It's shiny wet right now, but when it dries, it will probably be a little more matte. But it looks... So this... Um, uh, the apron that I'm working on is a really sturdy, thick fabric. So it definitely um, is a nice, solid surface for the uh, stuff to stick. Uh, a lot of times, like if I'm doing a shirt, sometimes it's thinner fabric. So I'm just going to dry this as much as I can real quick. Hi, Stacy. I just totally hit it. Ah, gotcha. Well, he runs all the time. A lot of, so we have four kids, and so we are um, always splitting up. Like, one of us goes with one, the other goes with another, or what, you know, whatever. Some may be left at home. <coughs> Not unattended. Uh, hi, Tammy. So, a lot of times, if we're, like, dropping somebody off, we can run and grab some things at the store, and then go pick up the kid and then come back or, you know, whatever it is. We just have an awful lot of commitments and things to do. Okay, so I'm not trying to get too hot because, um, whoops, the ink mat is under here and you don't want to, you don't want to get that hot because it'll, um, um, it's just, uh, you know, plasticky and you don't want to. Okay, so this is semi-dry. I'm going to let that go and work on these other things until that dries a little more, and then I'll put the flames in there and all of the other things. So I'm going to go ahead and close up my taupe. Boy, that looks really good. So, so good. Okay, now I need to do the words grilling and chilling um, I will probably that and is pretty small so I'm thinking I'll put this down I don't know what color I will do the grilling and chilling maybe white I think that looks like a nice option hey Jessica How's it going? I think you just got, oh, this is not gonna be centered. Let me move this over here. Oh, goodness. There we go. I kind of want, I think that, oh man. So stressful putting things in the middle and making sure they're the right in the right place. I don't know if you guys stress like I do about stuff, but it's stressful. Gr grilling and chilling, grilling and chilling. I need to move this over because it has the apostrophe. Okay, and then. And perfect. Okay, grilling and chilling is gonna be white. It's gonna be white. Um, I'm really jealous. I saw your picture. 
and um, not gonna lie, I mean, I enjoy what we have here, but I tell you what, it's not, it's not gonna be this summer because, well, you never know. I won't say never, but we definitely wanna get our own camper, and we do not have one. Um, we have two trips planned with somebody else's camper, which thankfully we can do that, like rent something, but um, oh, I just want to buy our own, but not yet. I have so many other things I need to do. So many other things that I need to spend our money on, goodness gracious. So yeah, so we don't, we don't have that yet, but I tell you, I am such a pool girl. Like I enjoy being at the lake or the ocean or wherever, but I would much rather be at a pool with no sand <laughs> and no animals. <laughs> Fish are not exactly my friend. So I guess I'm like a shark. Shark's not my friend either. I mean, let's be honest. I've swam with a shark, not by choice totally not by choice and um, scared the you know what out of me I mean it was it's cool now that I'm on land oh Jessica I'll come I will visit we will make a road trip let me tell you what I've got lots of people lots of people out east that I would love to visit and we could just make a big old road trip Hi, Rachel. Rachel, how are you? My gosh. I'm super excited. So yeah, the grilling and chilling is going to have an and in the middle. I just want to dry some of this so that I can do it without pulling up too much of the, the ink. Got it. This is looking so good, you guys. I can, I, I know you can see it in the video too. Um, for sure, Jessica, like, I'm not kidding when I say I'm going to, because you know my friend is moving out east, and I have other friends out east, and I have you out east, and I totally could just call it a business trip. Um, and Aaron would come with me. And then... I don't know. I mean, it would be fun. Should I? Yeah, I'm just going to do it. I'm just going to be boring and do it the regular white. I was going to say, oh, maybe I'll do it a different color, but nope. I changed my mind. And I usually don't make up my own mind that quickly. <clears throat> That's how you know I had a good day. Hi, Sherry. Hi, Laura. Okay. And there it is, grilling and chilling. Is that too close together? Everybody say no. Okay, totally. You've, you've talked me into it. Somehow I have to fit it in during my, um, you know, my so-called summer vacation where June is completely already taken, taken up. I mean, I'm not even out of school. I don't even get out of school till June 14th, so just so you know. All right. Grilling and chilling now. Um, I should do the flames and the smoke. It looks... Okay, thank you. I appreciate that because I kind of felt like it might be too close. All right, I'm done. No, I'm not done with the white. I'm going to do a technique on this right here. It's a flame, it's the first part of the flame. And I'm going to do like a blend of two colors. So here is a secret that you may not know, but when we first came out with our inks, there are there was this color, and it's orange. It's a beautiful colored orange. It's called Tangelo. And uh, we don't have this anymore because it's retired, but guess who does have it? Guess who has it for sale for her customers? And I mean, I'm just saying, I have some in stock. 
And this is the first time I'm using it live. Okay, so here goes our flames. I have to move my all my inks. Okay. I cannot wait till I use <gasps> Oh my gosh. You got to be kidding me. Oh my goodness gracious. I know that's like off camera and you can't see it, but I just completely 100% did the unthinkable. Oh. Seriously, people? Okay, well, it looks like it's coming out. <laughs> so that's good. I dropped... Hold on, let me show you. I dropped my red ink cap on this. See, I'm just super doppy at times. Um, but since it was still wet, most of it can't really see and frankly you know what it's an apron I'm gonna pretend like uh, I'm gonna pretend like uh, I didn't know anything that happened and I'm just gonna be like you got it dirty because you're cooking with it so there it came out I can't see anything of it oh hi Michelle <laughs> so yeah see I do silly things like that all the time <sighs> Oh my gosh. And I don't, I don't worry. I feel like when you've been crafting long enough, and this is my true, true 100% um, take on crafting, pretty much any mistake can be fixed. And I mean, like, true, true, yeah, I totally got ink on it. But, um, so I feel like a lot of people, they worry too much about things. Oh, my gosh. I'm so excited. You guys, look what my husband just brought me. This is, like, the best gift ever. And all I'm doing is making him an apron. I was hoping it was for me. You were? Yeah. When he said apron, I'm like, man, I can fry some fish in that tomorrow. Well, see, yeah. And then I had to tell people that we broke our... We didn't. I'm just going to say you did. Our grill? We broke our grill, so we're not No, grilling. it just... It's, it's just shot. It's a yeah cheap grill that went... Kaput. It went kaput. Got my eye on a new one, though. Yeah, he's got his eye on a new one. Okay, so there's my red and tangelo. You guys see that? Way to go, A.A. Ron. That's what Jessica says. Girl, oh, jacked up big. Ah, ha, ha. Yeah, see, I have not done that. And for real, if I did some, like, um, sipping and chalking for real on a live, I think I would be afraid of what I would do. Like, I would mess something up so badly. That looks like an Aaron Pac-Man. Um, Aaron says that my grill looks like an angry Pac-Man. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, no, you got a huge bubble. Well, I'm continuing to heat the same <laughs> spot on my ink mat, and it's, like, bubbling up. All right, I got to do the yellow. Ooh, I'm going to put my tangelo in red away before I do something horrible again. Gosh. You didn't dip your tangelo in your red, did you? No. I dropped my red cap on the apron, but I was able to wash it off. <laughs> I was able to wash it off. It's a totally... Okay. Here comes the... Okay, now I have to line this up. So if you see my head in the picture, I apologize. Never seen a white grill before. It's not white. Great. It's stainless. Oh my gosh, you guys! Did we not just talk about this? I'm sorry. It's I was, a black I was the apron. Kids a bit. It's a black apron. I know. 
and it's stainless. And I would rather, okay, so it was this, or I was going to do shimmery silver. Would you like to have glitter on your apron? Nope, stainless is good. See how, see? See? Gosh. Can never please him. Ever. Look at my little baby. That's my little baby. There should be a stick figure holding a beer or something. Um, I need a, st okay, can we get Tara on that? We need a stick figure and a beer. Stick figure and a beer. Holding a beer. Can we just get a whole set of, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I, I have an idea. We need a whole, like, family stick of figures. stick figures. And we can make fun family shirts Fun family, all kinds of things. I'm on it. I'm going to suggest it. Like, we need, like, several different stick figure transfers. Why can't you see? Because you're holding it the wrong way. Oh, if I swipe, I can. If you swipe, you can. Because you're using an iPhone. And you know how I feel about iPhones. Okay, hopefully, my flames look like flames and not mountains. <laughs> I didn't quite. I think it looks fine. Like Oh, you did a good job lining it up. Kind of. It looks way better, I think, in the commercial. I mean, in, in the, the video. video. From here it does, yeah. Uh, oh, gosh. Okay. Now we just have one more thing to do. And that is the smoke. But first, let's dry it a little bit. It's not as important that you, um, Tara is on my live and I just said we need to tell Tara that we need stick figures. Um, and I've decided we need a whole family of stick figures, a whole family. So like we need moms and dads and kids of all ages. I believe I suggested it. I believe my husband suggested it. <laughs> I'm going to put it, I'm going to do it. I'm, Oh, what am I trying to say? I'm going to... Request. Request it. Thank you so much. I'm going to request the stick figure transfers. I'm really excited. Like, we need a teenage stick figure and a little kid stick figure. And hi, Tammy. And we need all kinds, right? All right, here we go. The smoke is coming out of the grill, which is stainless and not black. And I have seen stainless grills that are like this and not black. I, Jessica, I'm serious. Like, I willed Tara to come on to my live. When I was doing this, I just said, I'm, I'm going to tell her. <laughs> Because I think it would be so adorable. We could have a pregnant mom stick figure. We could have like... Wait, Pac-Man's going to breathe fire. The f <laughs> This, okay, this not Pac-Man. It's a grill. Oh my gosh. This is going to be the best apron for this weekend ever. And you're going to wear I it. I am going to wear it. He is going to wear it because he's making... A, because, because our grill's broken. <laughs> no, okay, because we don't have a grill this, this weekend. We're not um, quite getting it yet. But I'm using a turkey cooker to fry fish. My husband is going to do a fish fry because we said something about fishing and he hasn't, he has fish in the freezer that he, we haven't cooked. And I'm like, well, you haven't cooked it and it's been like forever. And he's like, it hasn't been that long. I'm going to do it this weekend. So apparently we're going to do a fish fry. Um, Jessica just got, are you, are you looking at comments? Uh, she just, just got a stainless grill today. They exist. And, and you totally just said it. And I did. I, I did. Okay. So this is a super, super cute. I don't even need to really dry this because what's going to happen is. Guess who, I know whose side Jessica's on. Um, Jessica's on my side because she <laughs> loves me. This is my final product. And what you want is you want your ink to dry. And then um, 
you're going to press it with either your iron or you're going to use your a heat press of some sort, whatever you have, and you're going to put a sheet of parchment paper. Parchment. Yep. Ooh, he almost said it before me. <laughs> parchment paper first. You want to show? Yeah. Parchment paper. <laughs> that was my husband helping. Ah, Jessica said Team Sarah for life. So, this will all get pressed. <laughs> my press isn't over here, and I don't, like... If you're using a press, they actually, you can look at, so this apron, let me see if it has a tag. It does. So this tag says it's 100% cotton. So because the fabric is 100% cotton, I'm going to put on the cotton setting. And that's usually a higher temperature. I'll put my parchment paper down and heat it. If I'm using an iron, I'm going to do that for like four minutes over this and I think um, it should be good. They say front and back, so you can do the back. This is such a thick material. It was really nice to ink on. Um, it does, didn't go through the back. You know how some materials are thin and you can it goes through, but this did not. So on my heat press, what I'll do is I'll turn it to about 300, like 305, and I'll press it for 30 seconds in all the areas that need to be pressed. And then I'll flip it over and do the other side. Our goal is to get this ink, it actually feels really nice right now, get the ink to feel like it is one with the fabric. So you're not gonna feel any bit of that ink um, as it, like it's not gonna turn hard or anything like that. It's, it's just gonna be what it is. And so let me take it off of our awesome, ink mat and just kind of show you look how cute I mean manly this is so now because we you better because I just posted my new apron <laughs> <to share. laughs> because um, uh, we really don't have like manly aprons in our home we do have frilly aprons but so this is really cool grilling and chilling and um, so all of you at Chalk Couture, please um, take down my stick figure suggestion. And, um, because he feels, yeah, he wanted to have a stick figure guy. Okay, so that is my, my show for tonight. Um, remember, you can add in when you're doing stuff. Man, totally, I, thank you. Give me a little credit here. You can, there are so many other things that come with this transfer. You've even got the little, like, um, hot dog sausage brat thing. And then, oh, like, on the menu, number one best dad, oh, wait, number one best dad, grill master. So, like, I could have put these things on here if I wanted, but, um, I think this is great, and that's it. Make sure you share. Make sure you share this with I all did. your friends. Oh, thank you. You get bonus points. Um, and everybody else, I wanna, I wanna um, let you know that um, to go ahead and like my page and follow me on Facebook which is if you touch your screen, you're gonna see the link and then you can follow that link and make sure you like me and follow me. And then you'll get all of these because at the end of May, um, Jessica, seriously, so many possibilities. At the end of May, my lives are gonna go away from my profile and onto my biz page. Everything will be on the business page and that's it. So cheers to everybody. And have an amazing, amazing weekend. I will surely be back doing some more fun chalking. Maybe we'll have some chalking coffee in the morning. Okay, everybody have a super great night. Thank you so much for watching, and ta-ta!